Orbital engines and flight engines are both running at optimal levels here. We're ready for combat anytime. I don't doubt the enemy's mothership will try and attack, but you just leave that to us. Understood. Enlighten me on one detail before I go, if you will. Why exactly is Elise on the Courageous? You don't approve of my being here, Rain. But please, allow me the privilege of at least watching over you. I won't ask to accompany you like your classmates. I promise. That goes without saying. I know you can use a sword, but not anywhere near the level. Alright, alright, we get it. We know you're worried about her, but try and see things from her side. <laughs> if I may be frank, we couldn't ask for a better way to keep you in check than having her on board. <laughs> for once, we're in agreement. <sighs> Damn you guys. Thank you all for your support. As if anyone in here could turn down those doe eyes of yours, young lady. Remember, there are a lot of people here waiting for you to come home safely. Don't you dare do anything too rash! I concur. You need something to restrain them. You too, Valimar? <laughs> Afraid you're completely outnumbered, Reen. You're not going to change their minds, so you might as well just give up and accept fate. Come on, Reen. You should know when to pick your battles at this point in the game. Fine, fine! Thank you, Reen. And everyone else, too. <laughs> Honestly. Oddly enough, I think that little exchange helped ease the tension around here. <laughs> There's a break in the clouds ahead. Coming out into Heimdall airspace! Whoa! How can something like that exist? Hmm. That thing's gotta be like, what? 800 arch tall? It's called the Infernal Castle. It once appeared during the War of the Lions as well. And from there, it must have been sealed away by Drykul's the Lionheart and the Lance Maiden. What are they trying to do with it? Look, there! is 2500 it's coming this way they've activated their gun turrets they're not even issuing any warnings all engines full power land the ship in Draco's plaza touch any attacks coming our way aye aye captain 12 seconds till we reach max speed main cannons and secondary armaments are ready to fire all crew members prepare for impact and the effects of g-forces
no! Magic Knights! I figured they'd show up. Looks like Bellamar and I will have to... Leave them to us! The plan was that we would take care of everything here. And we will do so. Please, proceed onward. Patrick! Celestine! We'll be counting on you. Good luck! Back me up, Loggins! Right back at you. Here we go, Emily. Right! <laughs> As a member of the Florald family, I shall not be defeated. And I will gladly fight at your side, Master Vincent. Let's go, High Bell! What kind of second years would we be if we didn't help out our underclassmen? Let the battle begin! Rate, we might not have to actually do anything. Sounds fine by me. Still, don't you think it's about time you stopped holding back? <laughs> I haven't the faintest idea what you're talking about. Oh dear, it looks like we may have to fight after all. Ah, what's the world coming to when a guy can't even have a smoke in? Peace. Well then, let's not keep them waiting! Now's our chance. Take care, everyone! May Adios be with you all! Right! right. Begin rapid ascent! We need to draw the enemy mothership's attention! Aye, aye, Captain. Way to go, Reen! What great power! Wait! What's that? Is that some sort of spiritual wall? Yes, it's a spiritual barrier, and an incredibly powerful one at that. Oh, damn her! Whoa! Looks like it's not going to work. If Valimar can't break through it, there's no way Lammy can! Ugh. Isn't there anything we can do? I think there is. Thanks to the Zemurian Ore, I should be able to amplify my power and channel it through my sword. Can you do that, Valimar? It is theoretically possible. Bear in mind, the burden will result in me being immobile for some time. Sorry to ask, but let's do it! Spirit Unification! Cool. It's just like what Crow did with Ordeen. Now, everyone, let's get inside. Follow Reen's lead. All right. All right. Looks like we're just gonna have to leave everything to them now. Good luck, everyone. 
Kadios. Please watch over them. Okay, now this is a final dungeon! Words seem to have little meaning at this point. Yeah. All we can do is steal ourselves and get moving. Crow and the Azure Knight are in here, right? Yes. And I'm almost certain Vita is too. Duke Cayenne and the Crown Prince are likely accompanying them as well. Zeno and Leo are probably waiting in ambush somewhere around here, I guess. And I wouldn't be surprised if we met one or two Ouroboros enforcers along the way. How are you holding up, Reem? Not too tired? I'm fine, thank you. I have received several hours of rest being required. By my calculations, I should return to meet condition in time for the battle against the Azure Awakener. Good to hear. All right, ready to get moving? This place carries its weight in history, with ties to both the Divine Knights and the War of the Lions. But that doesn't matter. Not now, anyway. All that matters is that you're here, and you have everyone back at the Academy behind you. No matter what you face here, never forget that. Uh, thank you, Instructor. We won't. Well, with that said, Class 7, our mission is to investigate this strange castle and find a way to return things to normal. Remember, we're also here so we can carve out a future we've chosen for ourselves. If we want Crow to be a part of that future, it's time we show him just how far we've come by being together. There's no turning back from here. So let's just keep moving forward! everyone
Here we go. Ha! Now! An opening! It's my turn. Huh? Leave this to me. Very well. Marcus, activate! My turn. Arcus, activate! Huh. Of course! Arcus, activate! My turn! My turn. Shatter! Evil will fall before my blade. That should suffice.
Let's not overestimate ourselves. Stay focused. This might actually be a challenge. Good. My turn! Burn to ash! Fall! Now! There! My turn! Shatter! They're off guard! I'll back you up! I'll handle this. Now's our chance. Don't let it pass! Leave it Understood. to me! Of course! Isn't this a pleasant surprise? There's a trap. Let's not overestimate ourselves. Stay focused. This one's dangerous. Stay on your toe. This is bad. Too slow. Curse you. Your turn. I'm not done yet. this to you. I'll take it from here. Blessing of the moon. Thanks. Uh, should have been paying attention. My turn. Ha! My turn. Ha! Here come more. 
let's move. Arcade, damn! Blessing of the moon. Thanks. Let's move. There. Ha! Now's our chance. I'll back you up. My turn. Here I go! Ha! Gotcha. I wasn't strong enough. Here I go! Blessing of the moon! You have my face. I'll handle it. Here I go! Okay. Here come more. Okay. My turn. Here I go. Burn to ash. Fall. That's the power of the eight leaves. I did it! Hmm. Not bad. That should suffice. Done. <laughs> I've got this. No complaints here. I feel stronger than ever! Watch out! This is a tough one! My turn. Too slow. My turn. I'll handle it. My turn. Here I go. Burn to ash. Fall. Your chest is absolutely beautiful. Here they come. Careful, everyone. My turn. One, two, huh? and done. Now, let's get this over with. Understood. Right. All right. Here I go! Uh, ha! My turn! Arcade! Damn! Ha! Now! I'll back you up! Leave this to me! I leave this to you! I'll show you how it's done! Uh. 
My turn. Very well. I leave this to you. Understood. Evil will fall before my blade. Hmm. Not bad. Done. No complaints here. of the first stratum, most likely. Sense the wind rising upwards. I think that's some sort of magical elevator. I bet we can use that to go up to the next stratum. Not if I have anything to say about it! Well, well, look who finally showed up! <laughs> some people never learn. <laughs> My apologies for dropping in like this. Truly, our reunion could not come about on a more spectacular stage. If you mean in spectacularly bad taste, then sure. It is said that she too once challenged this legendary castle. There would be no greater honor for me than to be able to demonstrate my strength here. She? I assume she's referring to the Steel Maiden, Ouroboros' seventh anguish. Although, there are some who speculate her to be St. Leanne Sandlot herself. Come to think of it, weren't we saved by someone similar to St. Sandlot in Lohengrin Castle? How can someone who was alive 250 years ago be alive now? What nonsense. The possibility did cross my mind, but... Still, with a name like the Stalvary, it's abundantly clear that inspiration was drawn from the Lance Maiden and her Eisenritter, if nothing else. <laughs> Indeed. She saw my potential and guided me in all her wisdom. Graciously ushered me to new heights few could ever hope to reach. Someone from a mere branch like the Arsade School could never hope to compare. Ah. <sighs> Interesting. The chance to face an opponent related to my life's goal is a gift I am rarely presented. Duvali, it would be an honor to test my skill against yours. Neither to prove the Arsade School is more than a branch, nor to defend its name. But simply so that together, we may both aspire to greater heights. <laughs> That's our Laura. I think you've chosen the wrong girl to pick a fight with this time. Still, I'm sure she has her reasons for acting the way she does. Ha <laughs> I feel kind of sorry for her. Oh, stop staring at me like I'm some sort of naughty child! It's all very well to talk big, but it means nothing without strength to back it up. If I may interject, a spectacular stage is nothing without a spectacular cast. What say you, Class 7, to settling things between us in one last performance?
<laughs> it's a terrible shame I can't do the same with my worthy rival here and now. But there are certainly worse ways to pass the time than crushing the dreams of those with whom he placed his faith. Well, enough prattle. Shall we begin? You, with the power of an ogre, and you, the famous purple lightning. Show to me the beautiful emptiness that lies at the very depths of despair. If it's a fight you want, it's a fight you'll get. Don't hold back, because I certainly won't. On my name is the foremost knight of the Stone River. Do believe a swift. You shall be defeated. Ready your sword. Class 7, let's get this done and keep moving. All right. right. Now, dance beautifully. <laughs> it's the end of the line for you. I'll handle it. Here I go. Ha. Here I go. All right, let's do this. Understood. Have some of these. My turn. <laughs> okay. You're finished.
Got it! What? Here we go! I agree with you of the three. Now, die beautifully! Ha ha ha! Farewell! With pleasure. I leave this to you. I'll take it from here. Ah. My turn. Uh. Ah. My turn. Arcade Gale! <laughs> Yet. 
It's my turn. Sorry, can you handle this? I'll show you how it's done. Give up! Yeah! <laughs> Thank you very much. My turn. <laughs> this is impossible! I shall fulfill my duty as a noble. Not bad. I'm so glad. Success. <laughs> I've got this. I'm just getting started. That should suffice. <sighs> we were victorious. Ugh, that was some fight. They just didn't want to go down. The strength of Ouroboros' prime members is not to be underestimated. <sighs> Ah, well, you have aptly demonstrated that you can overcome despair. But alas, you may have been a little too unlucky with your opponent. What are you... This can't be happening. I couldn't have been defeated. The swordsmanship of the illustrious Steel Maiden could never be surpassed by this rabble! Impossible. Ridiculous. I won't let it happen! Too slow! What? <gasps> this is what she is capable of? So this is why they call her Dougalee the Swift. Her speed is incredible. She may not have a number among the Enforcers, but it's most assuredly not for lack of skill. So long as her lord wills it, she'll fight till she's breathed her last. And with that, the first act was a most impressive performance. But now begins our second act of despair. <clears throat> this isn't looking good. They've got the advantage now. There's no way we're getting past them. We need to find some way to turn this in our favor. <laughs> I'm afraid they have to bow out for now, but not to worry. The real stars of Act 2 have arrived. That sounds like... Could it be? Come on, pay attention now. Oh my! <gasps> They're fast! Your Highness, Toval! <laughs> if I didn't know you, I'd almost think you were there the whole time. You had to have planned that. <laughs> well, we weren't standing around waiting for the right time to make our grand entrance. I'll give you that much. Speak for yourself. And if you must know, Class 7, the situation in Western Erebonia has finally turned in our favor. And as soon as it did, we made for the capital as fast as we could. Even so, we only just arrived. Thank goodness for that. We're grateful to have your support. Ha ha ha! To think I would get the chance to face you here after all, Prince Oliver. The goddess has truly shined her light upon us. Or the devils have cast their shadows at the very least. Ugh! Who cares about a debaucherous prince in some bracer who's only as good as his arts? If you're going to try and talk big, at least bring Mueller Vander with you. Oh, but we did bring him. Pardon? 
Contrary to the inside, things weren't looking so hot out in front of the castle, so we asked him to stay out there and hold the line. His friend showed up to help too, so who wants to bet how long it'll take before they got everything under control? His friend? You couldn't mean... Sword of a Vander! He's incredible. So he's the young lion of the Vanders. I would expect nothing finer from those charged with protecting the Imperial family. Ladies and gentlemen of Thors, I've come to your aid. We should be able to handle everything here until reinforcements are... You're finished! Instructor Nightheart! You came to help us? Having him around will help even the odds a little. Nice to see you made it, Nightheart. I heard they were keeping you busy over by the east exit. Didn't think you were going to show up so soon. Brigadier General Wallace called for a temporary ceasefire in light of the current situation. Once I received permission from the Lieutenant General, I came here as fast as I could. I'm more surprised that you were able to make it this far into the city. <laughs> I'm only here because that idiot got it in his brain to burst in with his usual fanfare. But I left the babysitting duties to Tova, so not to worry. I can give this battle my full attention. Is that so? In that case, what would you say to a friendly wager? Say, which of us can take down more of these knights? You're on. We haven't had one of those since our days in the same battalion. Oh my! What a combination of chiseled physiques and battlefield camaraderie! Would you mind if I joined in the fun, too? Friend of yours, perhaps? Uh, let's just focus on fighting for now. You just leave things here to us. It looks like you've got quite the climb ahead of you. Rouse those fighting spirits of yours. Do what you can to save Cedric. Yes, your highness! We won't let you down! Kick some ass, Tovall! Oh, good luck. We're counting on you! May the blessing of the winds and the goddess be with you. <clears throat> You're not going anywhere! Your highness! <laughs> right there with you! Arcus, activate! activate. at the same time? What fun! How often does one get to do battle with two distinguished arts users at once? Then it seems I will have to demonstrate my proficiency with my own magic as well. This is not the time to try and one-up each other! Oh. Oh. 